Okay, on this video, I'm going to show you how to put the Porta Brace rain cover onto the CX405 camera. Um, and the reason I needed to make a video for this is this, in my 20 years of working in television, this is probably the worst design rain cover that I've ever experienced. Um, it's not easy to put on, it's kind of wonky and, and difficult. Once it's on, it really does protect the camera, but getting it on is a little bit of a pain. And the reason is, is if you look at this thing, you'll see it's all connected and, you know, it's just, when you're holding it up, you don't, it's hard to tell which, what goes where. So basically, to start, one of the things you want to do is it it's, makes it a lot easier if you lay, if you have a flat table to put this on. Uh, it's not easy when you're out in your back of your car or your, um, you know, you're, you're needing to get it on right away because it's starting to rain. This is kind of something where you really need to get this on, plan ahead. And so to do this with all these pieces, what you want to look for is this side here that has the Porta Brace logo. You want the Porta Brace logo sticking out to the right. And you'll notice, see this big long piece of strip right here? This will go around your lens hood. So have this laid out straight. Have the Porta Brace logo to your right. You want to have this piece clear with this little adjustable tab off to the left. And then this piece over that goes over, you want to make sure this long piece is to the back. With This is where your um, eyepiece will go through. So lay it out flat. All this stuff is, don't worry about that right now, just have it laid out. But this is how you want to lay it out on the table before you put it on the camera. And then what you do is, with your camera, what we're going to do is, you'll notice right here this little, this little tab. See, um, let me get it in the shot. See where this opening is right here? And you have these little tabs on the bottom right here. This is going to slip in the middle of your camera and this is going to tie behind. So the way that works is slide it over your camera right here. Pull it underneath the internal microphone and in the back behind your viewfinder, these two little tabs will Velcro together somewhat somewhat tight but don't don't do it too tight because you want to be able to have your viewfinder drop down on top that is the initial way that we're going to get that started it's pulling it up over the camera velcroing it behind the the eyepiece the next thing we're going to do is flip the camera around and right here this velcro we're going to secure this around the lens hood right like that. We'll flip it back around. Now this piece right here, we're going to flip this, pull all this stuff apart, flip it up and over. And this back, the very back one, there's two little openings right here. There's two little openings. And so the very back one, we're going to slip it over the eyepiece. Right like that. Slip it over the eyepiece. The second one is to put your hand in to get to the handle, to get to the internal controls. And so now, this piece right here, there's Velcro here, this is so you can open your viewfinder and you have access to your viewfinder right here. This just kind of lays over, okay? So when we turn it back around, you'll notice there is a piece of Velcro down in here. And all this does is Velcro's there to secure this. This just drapes over. And then in the back here, there's Velcro on the insides here. And that just Velcros to these flaps that come down. Like that and so then what you have is it basically lays over and 
this flap over, you can have a shotgun microphone. If it just lays over, it can Velcro down. And you just put your hand up underneath, up underneath here. On the other side, you have a clear here. You can put your hands up underneath to get to the lens hood. You have this on top that you can feed a light through or put your hand through. But that is essentially, it just kind of lays over, you know, like that. And so that is how you put the, the Porter Brace rain cover. It's not 100%. I mean, these open flaps and stuff, it's not real secure like some other rain covers, but it will work. It will keep things dry. There's plenty of clear openings to get to your menus, to see your viewfinder. Uh, you also have the eyepiece in the back you can use and pretty loose handling, so it does work. It works really well once it's on, but like I said, the very first time you try to put one of these on, it can be a little bit um, confusing, and you're like, well, how in the world is this thing going? But that's how you do it, and if you have any questions, come and see me.